What's happening, my lovely, wonderful people? You'll be surprised and shocked at the things that are currently on ground. Yes. Uh, Northern Elder says, that is uh, Baba Hamed. It says, if Tinubu becomes Nigerian's president, we will watch and see how he will assemble people to run the country for him. In his own opinion, Tinubu will not be able to run the country like he should. And he said, if Tinubu becomes president, he will be looking out for people to run the country for him. And uh, we all will be really surprised that uh, we think Buhari is, you know, people are running the country. He would do it by, he, he, in fact, he said, Tinubu zone will be worse. You know, he said Tinubu zone will be worse. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. If Tinubu becomes Nigerian's president, Nigerians, you will watch how he will, how he will assemble people to run the country for him. It is clear and very glary for us all to see. The spokesperson of the Northern Elder Forum, NEF, Baba Hamed, has opted on the very likely reaction of Nigerians if the candidate of the All Progressive Congress, Bola Ahmed Tinubu, eventually emerge as president of this country. Baba Hamed, who made this known through a Vanguard News column, which he shared on his verified social media handle, noted that Nigerians will pay much attention if the former Lagos State Governor makes make for himself a group of people that will lead and run this nation, even though he is the president if he wins. He said Nigerians may not help being worried and watch over the reports of his health condition, how he will keep on traveling and will not pay attention to look after the nation. Fear will rather engulf the nation if they insist on making him their president. One affair, one affair of this country will be run by different people who do not have anything to offer. He has no idea the President Muhammad Buhari's administration will continue. The spokesperson who was of the opinion that such points out that Nigerians will be worried that his national, his various reports, health status, may be liability for the entirety of us, will see what it means to put this man uh, in the position of the president. Bola Ahmed Tinubu as president will clearly open the eyes of Nigerians to his head status that is constantly being warned to Nigerians and his inability to lead a country like Nigeria. He is not healthy enough, he is not strong enough to bring us into that very kind of Nigeria that we all are looking forward to. Nigerians must become very careful and must be sure who they are voting for because we must look before we leap. If we continue like this and we do not mention and we do not do what is right, we will be shocked at everything that will follow. So this is what is going on, my wonderful people. This is what is happening. It is high time we realize who we are and what is happening. We must ensure that we do not allow the same thing to repeat itself again and again. Nigerians must ensure that they put the right things in place. Nigerians must ensure that they rise up to the they rise up to the occasion and vote the right candidate. Bola Ahmed Tinubu do not have anything to offer these people. He's not strong enough. So this is what is happening, my wonderful people. This is what is going on. Every one of us can see that it is time we rise up. It is time we do all that is needed. Yes, and everyone, you know, everything we need to do has to be put in place. Everything we need to do has to be put in place for this country to move forward. Every one of us must work. You know, every one of us must work and ensure that, you know, ensure that we are ready. Okay? Every one of us must ensure that we are ready to bring this country right back on track. The issue of what is on ground today is it's clear to every one of us that uh, there are some people that are really playing with what is important. What we should be focused on, we are not focused on that. We are, we are actually playing with what we should, you know, really pay attention to and ensure that we do not allow, you know, people who are, are doing everything to put this country in a terrible state, we do not allow them to continue. You know, every, every time we neglect the place 
Okay, every time we neglect the place and the opportunity for us to get into the right place, it will affect us all. Nigerians, the issue and everything we are faced with today, it calls for urgent attention. Nobody should sit back there and think that things are suddenly going to fall, fall in place if we do not rise up to the occasion and we do not do what is necessary. The days upon us have become very expedient, you know, that we do everything right to bring this nation right back on track. So it is what it is. It is what it is. Every one of us must ensure that we work at it. Every one of us must ensure that we do not allow the same thing to hold us you know, to hold us where we are at today. Yes, Nigeria back, you know, in the place we are supposed to be. Let's put this nation out of the current, you know, oppressiveness that is going through. There are all kinds of people who are not honest, who are not truthful, who are not really ready for this country to move forward. And all that they are engaged in and all that they are doing clearly shows, you know, the kind of issues and the kind of matters that are in their hands. And um, if we want this change to become permanent, there are things we must work on. There are things we must focus on. The truth is every day and every time we neglect the opportunity for the real change that we deserve, it affects us. Every day and every time we have that opportunity for the change and we do, not, and we do nothing about it, it will affect us all. Yes? So when you look at it, you can see for yourself Nigerians, what are you doing? What am I doing? What are we doing? Are we going to just sit back there and assume that things are suddenly going to change? It's not going to happen. No, it's not. It's not going to happen. It's going, only going to happen when we work at it, we are determined. Yes? Leave us a comment. Don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. God bless. Have a fantastic and a lovely day. Remember, you have a voice. Yes. Every one of us have a contributing factor in all of this. Every one of us must contribute willingly, okay, intentionally, and we must work for it. Every one of us must continue to see, you know, that um, the opportunity and everything that is presented to us is so that we can make a good choice. These are not the former days where there was really no uh, proper information dissemination processes in place. Today, the world is a global village. You know what's going on. Make the right choice. God bless. Have a fantastic and a lovely day from us. It's bye for now.